Oldham County Real Estate Market Update, March 29th, 2022. Hey, it's Darren Bailey with Caldwell Banker McMahon and just wanted to go over some stats I looked at this past Friday. Um, and we're gonna look at closed sales so far in 2022. So we've had 148 closed single family homes in Oldham County so far this year, wrapping up the end of the first quarter um, for about $67 million uh, in sales volume. Of the 48 sales, 57 or almost 39% have gone less than list price. Uh, homes priced between 300 and 500 saw the most negotiation. Um, almost 42% of the homes that sold within three to five um, went for less than list price. Uh, you take out the highest price uh, list drop was $120,000 on a million dollar property. And the average amount below list comes out to just under 16 eight. $16,800. Now on the other end of the spectrum, there were 91 homes that sold at or above list, and that equals 61%. Um, and again, the 300 to 500 price range also saw the most activity. 49% of the homes in that price range went at or above list price. Um, and then the average buyers are paying above list price is just under $6,400. Thought that would have been a little bit more, but that's what the numbers are coming out at. Uh, sales are scattered all over the county. Goshen comes in with 20 sales. There were 35 in Crestwood. LaGrange had 58 sales. And then Pee Wee Valley, Prospect, Smithville, Westport combined for another 35 sales. Um, average days on the market is right at 26 days. Um, however, there were 86 homes that sold within the first 10 days. And there were only 12 that were on the market for 90 days or more. So it's still looking good for sellers. Uh, financing was pre predominantly conventional. 70% uh, of the sales were conventional. 16% were cash. 13% were either VA uh, or FHA. So if you're considering selling your home in 2022, and like a detailed breakdown of how this market impacts the value of your home, feel free to reach out to me. Give me a call. Darren Bailey, 502-807-5648. 502-807-5648. Thanks.